Hello everybody, what is up? Welcome back to another episode of Skyward Zord. In the last episode, we did nothing. No, not really. We got the second part of the song. Now, today, we're getting the second to last piece of the song, because guess what? We're progressing in this game. Yay! That's always nice, right? I love progressing. Progressing is fun. It really is. So, let's... Take the 5 billion mile journey over to Lanayru, or whatever it's called, I think it's called Lanayru, I'm, I'm probably not even pronouncing that right. Go through it, go through it, because this is a goat, apparently. Get through it, goat. At least it's not so bad, because we do have another thing, a rock. Yeah, that's what this is, a rock. Like, do they even ever explain what this is, to be honest? Because it's like, they're just here. I don't even know if they explain what that actually is. My bird flying skills suck. Like, where did I get my bird license? Like, where did I get it? Not Link, because Link's okay. Where did I get it? Point to your preferred destination. I don't know where that is, though. I don't know where I want to go. Um, do I want to go here? Because we have to go over here. I, I'm pretty sure I know where that is. If we go to the ancient harbor. This isn't the fastest way, I don't think. But I don't remember where the thing is. That's the thing. <clears throat> like, I don't... I said that completely wrong. Like, I don't know what bird statue... Like, I keep forgetting what bird statue is over there. Can I not do this? I believe I can... Oh, man. No! I think I can do this. I should be able to do this. Is there a thing over there that I can claw shot? No. Hello? I should be able to do this, right? Oh, over here. <laughs> I think. I've never done this. Yeah, I've never done this before. I didn't even know you could do this. Like, I don't think I've ever... I've, oh, come on, get centered. I don't think I've actually ever done this. Seems really weird. I, I think I'm going in the right direction, because I think there was another way that we could have gone over here, but we didn't go through it. I don't know why we couldn't go through it. Oh, the Gorn was mining it, wasn't it? Like, isn't that the thing? Like, I think he was mining it, and now it's like, plot regression. He's done, because plot. That's why plot is so nice, because plot just has its own way of doing things. Now, I believe we can go to the right, and... Yeah, hey over there, is that you? <laughs> nice timing, I've been meaning to look for you. Have you? Come over here for a minute. So yes, look, he mined this out. I don't want to talk to you, Mr. Tree Stump. Have you ever found that sacred flame? Well, that was like five years ago. I would say how many episodes that was ago, but I, I honestly don't remember. You were pretty amazing. Hey kid, I like you. Ocarina of Time reference, I think that's Ocarina of Time anyway. I found out there is indeed a hidden area behind here. Well, with that pickaxe, you should be able to make a bigger hole. I don't know why you couldn't. Oh wait, plot. The Thunder Dragon, a bunch of robots, and time shift stones. <laughs> He's thinking. He's stonking. What a story. So yes, this is what it is. Or where it is. We got, we got a rock here. Okay. And that's really weird to do. I don't know why. I think it's because I don't have that much room to actually do that. Like, to actually, like, put my arm down and roll it. Like, I don't have that much room here, which is why you might... I like how we just now hid. But that might, like, that's probably why you might hear, like, sometimes hear, like, my desk and all that. Because I don't have that much room to do stuff. New area! Yay! This is Lanayru Gorge. Legend tells of a dragon. Ho-ho, a dragon, but what are those bones I see? I wonder whose bones those are. Oh, I see a god of stone cube. Oh, wow, the screen kind of blacked out there. Mm, ancient life. Is this screen supposed to be doing that? I don't, like, it feels weird. I don't remember that. Consequently, the terrain is in something. <laughs> Whatever. So many words! We got a we got a new area, nice. The Lanera Gorge, the final area of this part. So it's cool. So basically, we're gonna be going like a giant square or circle, half circle. Like, well, actually, yeah, circle. 
Because we're going to end up going into that door that you see. And we're going to go all the way there. That's where we're going to exit out. But obviously we have like all this to do. Like all of that. So that's probably going to take a while. So let's get this out because I see this. And this is this. Come on. Oh, actually, there is no fuse timer when you grab a bomb this way. I forgot. And one thing that might not particularly be obvious to you. that That's not obvious to you. Haha, -ha, I fooled you, didn't I? You didn't think I would do that. I'm so stupid. <laughs> but anyway, one thing that might not be the most obvious is if you come down here, there's actually a key. That th you see that thing off in the distance? Yeah, that's actually a key. Can I get this? Oh, please tell me I can get this. I don't need to be upgraded, do I? Well, if I was upgraded, that definitely would have helped, but... This is weird. The only reason why I knew this is because I watched... Like, I watched a Let's Play of this game before I even played this, so that's the only reason why I knew. I don't know how you're supposed to... Well, I guess by looking, but... I don't know if there's, like, a sign, or, like, a sign that tells you, or, okay, <laughs> goodbye, ants. Or, like, if Fi tells you, fee fi fo fum or does it tell you? Enter to the area ahead as allowed by permission, the Thunder Dragon. But he's dead. He's over there and dead. He's deader than dead. He's, like, the dead. He's a, he's a death. That's what he is. So, we're gonna have, like, all this. We're gonna have a grand time. Like, a... Uh, the grandest oh that's the wrong thing the grand we're gonna have the grandest grand time of the grands uh i can't aim this is where the sensor thing the motion gets weird like grabbing onto the pea hats that's it, it's really weird because every time you grab onto a pea hat it's wherever your current position like your current position with your hand is that's can you not hit this okay there wherever your current position is when you actually like, grab onto the next p hat that's where your that's where like your default thing is if that makes any sense it probably doesn't <clears throat> so let's go let's can you not go um um oh we got to talk to him for plot progression there are lots of big time shift stones here. Did you get permission from Master Thunder Dragon? No, I did not. <laughs> Link should have just flat out said no. I, I wonder what would have happened. Oh, now it moves. There are many monsters here, <laughs> and you're dead. Like, okay, goodbye. Uh, I I'm pretty sure I had to talk to him because it wouldn't move anywhere out. Like any, like it wasn't moving because I can speak. So this goes slow. Like it, it's um. It's not that hard to actually do what you have to do. There's just a lot of these enemies in the- oh man. <laughs> usually when they're just coming up, you can like... Like usually when they're just coming up, you can get them. But apparently not. There we go, get that, get this plant before it disappears. That was good. And die. No, I said die. Uh, oh, there we go. Yeah, good thing about the powered up sword is that it only takes one shot. Well, actually, it's the yellow ones that took two shots. These ones always took um, one shot, didn't they? But these ones, like, if you miss it, they can go um, sideways. Okay, I'm slow. I don't know why. Oh, he's on the button. Well, he's not on the button. It's right there. <laughs> Thought he was on the button for a second. Come on. <laughs> Just with my sword out looking stupid. Like, look at this. Okay, this is where you want to, yeah, like, you want to <laughs> just swing like a madman, because usually, like I said, when they come directly up, that's when you want to, like, that's when you want to hit them, because they're too stupid doing their animation. They're too stupid, they're too busy doing the animation. Well, there's a thing up here, is it not? Yeah, it is, okay. Oh, <laughs> I don't know why I didn't see that. Well, actually, the thing wasn't here, that's why. Because this is the past, after all. The past is the past. I don't know how that's really connected to the door. There must be, like, wiring inside this organic mountain. Which, I don't know how they pulled that off without making some sort of dent. But that's cool, right? <clears throat> 
So yeah, this is cool. Like it's going slow, but while it's moving, you have to like do all this stuff, which is something I really like. I don't know why that cube's over there. Or platform. I don't know why I called it a cube, but it's not a cube. It's not even whatever. And with this one, you do have to be fast. Not too fast, actually, but the reason why you have to be somewhat fast is because if you don't go fast enough, it'll leave you like that. And let's do this. I was actually scared there for a second. I'm like, wait, what am I supposed to do? This is cool. It's like drawing itself out while we're actually going on it, if that makes any sense. So here's, come on, hurry up. The butt crack of the earth is, is right there or something. Okay, there's a stamina fruit. Come on, hurry up. Hurry up. Oh man, we have to wait. I, actually, I think I could have gone there, but I, don't, I didn't want to risk it. Come on, the earth has so many butt cracks. Go, oh my god, I, th I thought I missed that because I was like, Hesitant and rather or not to go. Um, that wind was like right in my face. I believe we go over here now, right when this. What? Um. Is this where we go? Is this? Yes, it is. Okay. Yeah. Sometimes when you're at the end, it'll stop because you know you have to open the door to actually progress. But other times it'll keep going, and it's like, wait, what am I supposed to do? Well, what I'm supposed to be doing is getting the center. That's what I have to do. I like how these things fade in and out of existence. Like, when it goes to... Like, when the thing goes over to them. They just die. Because those things are... not Like, the bats are in the present, not the past. So it's cool. They just, like, despawn. This thing, yeah, like... With, um, with this, it's really weird. Like, it's not actually... Like centered or something it's only like at this part i don't know why but it should be correct let's see do i do we drop down i don't know i don't know okay there's a patch of grass there, <laughs> there we go i don't remember this like i said it, well i didn't say anything but it, it's been a while since i've done this like i said as if i even explained something i'm not gonna pick that up i don't care I don't know if these guys can even hurt you if they slow you down. I think they can hurt you. Kill you. Kill you. <laughs> Just casually slashing them in the face. Gotta get the whip. Nope. Okay, I didn't think that was actually gonna work. Because I, like, I whipped up. <laughs> yes. How many times have you said that? I whipped up. How many games can you even say that to? Okay, with these, it's best to go on the sides, because, you know, obviously they have to take, like, a longer path to actually get to you and die. Oh, oh we're, we were already on it. We have to do this kind of quick, because this is the part where, if you're not quick enough, it'll leave you behind. You don't have to be that quick, but kind of relatively quick. Aha! Okay, I thought I was going to fall. <laughs> That scared me. Die, die. Oh, I wanted to... Wait, what? I was too fast there. The cart pushed me. Why have you done this? I actually want to see how much damage this takes. Okay, that's actually a lot. I'm not doing that again. I'm putting my shield away. Not really. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, okay, this part is kind of weird. Because you have to wait until it goes. Like, it's, um, it's electrified because we're in the past. When it's not in the past, then we can actually run through. No, okay, I think I, yeah, I messed it up. <laughs> I didn't mean to hit that. Not to start the entire thing over again. Yeah, I have to start the entire thing over again. And you're alive. I didn't say you could be alive. You're not supposed to be alive. That's not how things work. I'm not going backwards, am I? No, okay, I was gonna say I'm not going backwards. That would have been weird. There was a rare flower there. That was, I don't know why I did that. I'm going to keep whipping you so you don't actually lunge at me, but your friend did, so I guess that was not worth it. <coughs> Let's see. Wait, can they not actually hit me? If I'm like, wait, let me see. Come on. Oh, yeah, they can. For, for some reason, the other one didn't hit me. So I guess what you could do 
is you could be like right here and prepare for it because it will stop at roughly right here so you do get like running time let's see yeah it stops about right here so you want to make sure get all the stamina fruit because if you miss one that's actually it like you can't do this without getting all the stamina fruit I i've tried you will die <laughs> that's kind of rough but you pretty much will die or unfortunately yeah fortunately if only that was fortunate i'm almost well i'm not almost dead <laughs> i'm almost dead but i'm not so that's a good thing i want the other shield no, okay, that... Actually, we don't need to do these guys. Like, we don't need to kill these things. Well, not all of them, because they don't... They're not all in the way. This one's in the way, though. We need to kill you. Look over here so I can... You stupid... Okay, there. I, I didn't even hit that thing in the eye, but it still counted somehow. No, how did you hit me? You're so... Like, they're so annoying. Like, just because of that one reason like stupid electrified stuff like where are the elemental um <laughs> like where are the elemental things you know what i mean okay i i would take a potion but i don't know if there's a stool i should not be taking this much damage though like i'm <laughs> i should be a better player um okay i should be a better player can i get this i can't i need to use my whip i need to rip whip you i need to rip you yeah Rip you to shreds. <clears throat> okay, there's this one part coming up that I never really understood what to do. I don't know if this is what you have to do. Like, I usually take uh, the beetle and I usually just fly a bomb to it. Because what you have to do is you have to, um, you have to blow up that rock. Like, that rock that you see. Because obviously it'll block it. So what I do... I, well, I, I guess this is what you're supposed to do. This frame rate again. Didn't mean to do that. But what I guess you're supposed to do <clears throat> is center the thing, because that's always what you have to do. But get one of these bombs, preferably the one that's actually sticking up, and do it like this. I guess this is what you're supposed to do. It just feels really weird, though. I mean, what else would you do? I don't know. For some reason, I thought you had more options. Maybe I'm thinking of something else. I probably am. I think one of these oh, killed two birds with one stone. Nice. I think this one's a yellow one. Yeah, okay. But you can one-shot him like that. He didn't even start yet. <laughs> so now, the cool thing about this is this is all relevant because when this thing gets to the top, it'll fit right here. And cutscene. Where's Link? Link? I think Link died. Link, like, despawned from the world entirely for this one thing. So, this is going to be interesting. I guess this was the trial. Like, I, I do think this is, like, the shortest of the trials. Well, I guess if you want to call them a trial. I guess the water one can be shorter. I, I, I kind of messed that one up. I don't know. Like, I'm only at 20 minutes. I'll probably end up fin finishing this just because I know how. But, let's see here, just because. Get her health back. <clears throat> I wasn't actually aware that this stool was here. I don't remember seeing it last time. But we did that. So let's go over to the dragon. Cough, cough. Oh, you sound like me, dude. Oh, hello. I haven't had a visitor like you here in quite a while. You're a human. <laughs> well, yes, I am a, hear uh, a hearing. A human. I'm a human that can hear. It looks like you just took a bath and you have like a bubble beard. That's what it looks like. For some reason, this guy has like what looks like, you know, from Ocarina of Time to be like the the Zora Sapphire, which you would think the water one would have this, but it, no, it just it, it's just really weird that it would be like desert slash thunder. Didn't you just say you you came from the sky? Yes, I'm like you. Kind of, because you have a sky beard, that must mean that you came from the sky. A sky beard is in the clouds. <laughs> His beard does look cool, though. And to think, it was the goddess herself who entrusted me with the important duty. I feel the deepest shame. I wonder how he got sick. I don't think they ever explained that part. Maybe, maybe they don't. 
So what we have to do is come over here and notice how everything is dead. Actually, no, there's a time shift stone here. I was going to say, how do we get the time shift stone like over to this area? But this is important because we need this. But you will see why we need to do this. Why do we need to do this? Well, for starters, there's an area over here. They wouldn't put an area that you do nothing in. That would just be stupid. Oh, come on, really? I, I think I have to, like, recalibrate the thing. Let me do that again. Um, uh, am I moving? Yeah, I think I'm just not moving my hand right. Whatever. So this does this. See how the, the tree is, like, grown, but it's dead? Now it's a sapling. That's cool. It's, it's magic. Now this thing's in the ground when it shouldn't be in the ground. It looks really weird. Because that's not exactly how that would work. <laughs> There's no hole or anything. It's just clipped into the ground. So, let's not do that. Thankfully, Link has the brain power to dig it back up. So, let's dig this up. You got the nut. That looks cool, actually. What are you doing with that seedling, verm? <laughs> like, I, wouldn't the exclamation question mark come from what are you doing and not the verm? Of course. I should say not really. I don't- I've never seen anyone say, like, no. Like, they're not helping. I wonder what they would say. Like, he'd be like, you monster. But, this is the cool part. What we actually do with this seedling. This is cool. I like this. I really like this. So, let's go over to the sky, because we need to go to the sky, which is above our heads. But look what happened! This happened, and now we need... I think this is how you do this, right? Oh, is this the part that I was thinking of, like, I don't know if this is what you're supposed to do? Maybe this is, but I always took my beetle and just flew directly into this spot. Like, this doesn't feel right, but apparently it... Like, if it works, it must be right, because that logic usually works, right? So, let's go over to... Don't wear yourself out. That but that sounds like a cool city. Let's go to the sky. The blue area. And, now that we have the seed, you, you'll see what I'm doing shortly. But... We are going to... The, the place, the you know, that one with the grass, the fair and woods, except we're not going to the woods part, we're actually going to another part, which is the sealed grounds, and if, you, if you've seen the past couple of videos, previous videos, I mean, you'll know why, or you'll know what this is leading up to, and it's going to be great, because I said so, why are you following me, I don't know why you're following me, you don't even have the attack that I do, you're not even on my level, get on my level. Plus, please, get on my level, please. Okay, so let's go. Are we close enough? How far are we? We're actually not that far. And drop. Well, actually, it dives for you if you're too close. But let's go. Point to your preferred destination. Let's go. This is not the sealed grounds. For some reason, sometimes I think this is a sealed ground when it's not. Be actually, no. Wait, yeah. Well, I was thinking, I think behind the temple is actually a shorter route. Well, I'm pretty sure behind the temple, like behind the temple is a shorter route to actually get inside, but oh well. This ain't no speedrun. If this was a speedrun, I would have completed the game ages ago. Not that I would ever imagine myself to be a speedrunner. I've never got that log. I don't know where that goes. Like, I, I've never... Actually, now that I think about it, I don't think I've ever pushed that log down. Have I? You have to push that log down at some point, do you not? Because I think I'm almost done with the game. Like, I'm about to... Not about. There's still, like, one big final dungeon to do. But then it's, like, the end. After we fight the last boss, that is. Well, two more bosses, I guess. No, wait. One boss, yeah. Because the final dungeon, or temple, doesn't have a boss, I don't think. I don't remember. Like, I really don't remember. But, let's go over here and plant this. This is gonna be cool. Impo, can you watch this? There you go. And notice how it made the sound, the, the jingle that we did a good? 
So we did a good and Link has done a deed. So if we do good and we do a deed, which is basically the same thing, kind of, then we go back to the presence and let's see what happens. We got a cutscene. <laughs> and we get a tree with the fruits. Which is weird, because if you think about it, the Groose, now that we, we like, changed the Groose's mind, kind of. Because, like, to him, he's always seen this tree. Which is kind of weird and creepy when you think about it. Like, something so minor that Link did, it changed, like, Groose's entire thinking. Well, it, you know what I'm trying to say, it's really weird, though, how that works. But... Yeah, sorry these videos have been, like, so long. I don't, like, I haven't been meaning for them to be this long, but it's, like, I'm so close to the end of, like, these songs. Like, usually, like, I'm at the 20-minute mark, and I just see myself, like, oh, I'm so close to the end, I might as well finish this. But, yeah, when I give this fruit to the dragon, the dragon lord, then we'll stop the video, because then that'll be, like, the song. And it'll be cool. And I'm kind of not looking forward to the next video. Because I know what's happening in the next video. It, it's not going to be too hard. I don't... Well, hard is probably... Um... <laughs> I don't know. But it, it's not really that hard. It's just more annoying than anything. <coughs> oh, coughing and flying at the same time. I'm, I'm so good. I said I was bad, but I'm actually, like, really good. I'm secretly good. Secretly, secretive secrets. Wait! Okay, I... Oh, man. I was about to say it. Like, I had, like, a major brain fart, like, in that past second. I'm like, wait. I didn't activate the bird statue, but it's like, dude, I, I used that bird statue to get out. Like, what do you mean you didn't activate it? Just weird. It, it didn't process in my brain for some reason. <clears throat> so, let's use a sailcloth. To be honest, you don't need to use a sailcloth because it, it uses it for you. Like, if you use a sailcloth, that actually kind of, like, delays you. Like, if you were doing a speedrun, you wouldn't use the sailcloth is what I'm trying to say. Let's see, let's see what you do. Oh, Joe, hello there. Is there something you need? No, there's something I want to give you. And then Link just magically pulls out this giant fruit out of nowhere that's, like, bigger than he is. I don't understand, but... Oh, oh, is that what I think it is? Like, if this guy had a voice, you could, like, imagine how, like, how he would sound. <laughs> imagine if that would have missed. You know how bad that would have been if that would have missed? Like, that would have sucked. I can only imagine. I'm flying! Well, he's flying, but I'm talking for him, which really doesn't make sense. <laughs> he's like, you've done it, man, you've done it. Even though that dialogue passed, like, a minute ago. A minute being, like, ten seconds. Nick is smiling. He's so happy. Just because I have eternal life doesn't mean I can't get mighty sick. But, but, where do you draw the line between, like, getting sick and eternal life? Like... You can't, well, I, I would assume it's, you just can't die of old age. I'm talking from the song, but you can't die of old age. That would still suck. Because I, I wouldn't say most people die, like, like, you know, a lot of people do die of old age. But a lot of people also die from, like, a disease or being sick, which I guess is the same thing, which is kind of sad when you think about it. But it's the truth. Like, how many people have you heard recently that have actually died from old age? Like, a lot of people... I'm not trying to be, like, a pessimist here, but it's like... And, man, it's just... When you think about it, a lot of people, like, die from diseases. Like, rarely... Well, I don't know if I would say rarely, but it's not too often that I see people... Or not see, but hear about people actually dying of natural causes. Like, of age. Because age is everything, right? So anyway, that's going to be the end of this video. So in the last video, we go back to Levias, or something, the whale guy, Whalmer, not Whalmer, it's definitely not Whalmer, it's Whale Lord, <laughs> Whalmer. So anyway, guys, that's that. We're going to go to him in the next episode and then do what we have to do. So with that being said, see you guys later and good boy.